Hello everybody and welcome back to Promise Gaming and more CK2, Prince of Darkness, playing as Serene Doge Manfredo of Genoa. I've done a bit of thinking in between videos as far as where I could continue building trade posts to try and expand my little kingdom here. Um, I think some of the more obvious answers would be to go for this little guy right here. He is liege to a relatively small nation, so we could probably grab a city down here, wouldn't be too bad. Uh, we could also try building one in Rome. And the advantage of that is I think we break the stranglehold that Pisa has over this particular uh, sea zone tile. And, um, I mean, it'd be kind of fun to be able to take over a city in Rome if we wanted to later, right? The city of Viterbo. Or however you say that, I'm not too sure. So yeah, between those two, that seems like a pretty reasonable answer. Um, or we could continue building tall here in France, which I have heard it said... That building tall in a trade zone is generally better. Might even be true, I'm not positive. So this would be an option, is to kind of start building some more trade posts here in France. But what are the odds that I'm going to be able to attack France, right? This guy here with his 11,000 troops, not very good. So as far as expanding Genoa, I don't think that's much of an option for me. Now what we could do, that I was thinking about, is actually declare a holy war. Wait, no, not against you, hang on, this guy. We could declare a holy war for Barcelona, if I wanted to be crazy. Now, nearby Sunni rulers might uh, offer to join in defense of their faith. Which, you know, obviously there's quite a few of them. Then again, there's also a lot of Catholics. This is the Crusader Kings game, after all. We're in the Crusade era. Who knows? Maybe Castile, Navarra, Leon, Galicia decide they want to help join. Maybe France wants to help join. Who knows? But this is an opportunity for me to try and grab two more provinces. Which I do like the idea of doing. So I think we give it a shot. Let's try declaring a holy war for Barcelona against your 500 men. Hopefully not a lot of people join. Obviously we're going to call in Pisa here. Uh, can't do anything about my retinue right now. I probably should get my, um, my half-brother married. Hello, Emma, Princess of France, my lover. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know about that. Let's try... This lady is really pretty well balanced in a lot of ways. Let's try marrying you here. That'll work fine. Okay, good. I mean, they're probably not going to have very many kids, if any, but whatever. It's it's a worth a shot. It's worth a shot. Okay, get my men together here. Olga is trying to kill the patrician. Good. Kill him. Another person is joining my court. They are getting married. Mazel tov. And Pisa is joining my war like a good little tributary that they are. Okay, we need to get more freaking commanders is what I need. Is the epidemic gone yet? No, of course not. Why would it be? It's too much to ask for. I mean, there's really no one else that I'm able to get, I don't think. We could probably replace you. Is he in seclusion? He's not. So let's put him in charge. Have you take this flank. Let's go siege down his top holding. I'm going to try to take these two provinces here in the Iberian Peninsula. I think that'll be fine. Wait, what just happened? Uh, my marshal is apparently dead. Oh, he died! Yes, I got the barony back! Okay, another another thing went... Another thing. Another family went extinct. And that's a lot of respect gone. So, who should I give the land to now? The cursed barony. You already have something. What are the odds I can kill you quickly? Not good. How about you? Pretty good. You have a hundred ducats left. I could probably kill you. You have a hundred ducats left. Or... I stick to my original plan and only focus on the guy who has the Cursed Barony, and I give this away to somebody else. Maybe someone on my council, make them landed, make them stronger. I could give it to my half-brother. It's always an option. Um... Let's see if we can find someone really good in my realm. Maybe even preferably, maybe even preferably in my court. Let's see. Somebody with really good stats. Uh, it has to be a man, unfortunately. There we go. You're pretty decent. Prince of... Oh, he's the Prince of Sweden. I don't necessarily want to give him that. This person holds a lot of claims. Interesting. The Marshal of Genoa. I could give my Marshal some land, give him a barony, make him stronger. Kind of like this guy, though. 
He has claims on Cornwall. Maybe him. He's younger. Marshall's going to die relatively soon, and then I'll lose these stats. I'm going to give you the landed title. The Barony of Monaco. Congratulations, you're landed. I hope you're happy. Okay, Vassal Inheritance Warning. Eh, it's probably fine. So yeah, that means that now I need to focus all my efforts on killing this guy. This is the one who is marked for death. Bring everybody into the plot. Anybody that I could persuade with a little bit of money. My courtier here. Yeah, good enough for me. All these other people are already going to join. Okay. Let's take a quick look-see and see if there are any other people in the cult who want to join. You'll be fine. We'll invite you to court. Everyone else kind of sucks. He actually would make a pretty good um, commander as well. The Prince of Sweden is trying to kill somebody. He doesn't have any money, so imprisoning him does very little. I'll, I'll let you continue doing what you're doing. I mean, I hope you don't succeed, but meh. At the end of the day, is it the worst thing ever? No, probably not. Let's continue building some trade posts. I'm going to build one down here, probably. Well... It's not really controlled by any particular family. Let's break uh, Pisa's stranglehold over this trade zone. That'll be fine. And maybe we end up fighting Roma later. Since they're not actually a part of the Papal State, this is one of those few opportunities that I'll have to take that. Arrange marriage with Elisa, my courtier, who I'm pretty sure despises me and told me never to talk to her again. So I can marry you off to the steward of Aragon. The Queen of Aragon wants her. Or Pisa wants her. Mm, Pisa may have her. Is the epidemic gone yet? Yes! I can open the gates. Thank you! Open the gates! My plot power immediately jumps up. I get some diplomacy back. Can I heal myself now? Let's try healing myself of the dark, um, of the lover's pox. Try this again. It could be I'm using it too freely. People are becoming suspicious. Uh-oh. And we got rid of lover's pox. Thank you! Alright, that's no longer a problem. Uh, somebody is sieging down my trade posts, or rather, my vassal's trade posts. Let's see, I'm going to put my half-brother in charge. It's good for him to get some experience. Isnardo, you will take the other side. Let's go crush these losers. Actually, come here. Okay, he's going to his capital holding. No, 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 no. Stop letting people know that I'm trying to kill someone. This is the problem with inviting a ton of people. Some of them might be drunkards, and then it doesn't work very well. Okay, can I trap you? Where are you going? Okay, he's faster than I am, I think, which is making things a little difficult. A daughter was born to my witch! Oh, yes! Good, that'll work. Apparently, though, apparently... Oh, I could torture my brother. Um, apparently, uh, I don't have to legitimize her in any way. Not sure how that happened. Where are you going? You're going here? No, you're not. I'm going to trap you here. Come here, buddy. Ah! Couldn't get there in time. Split the armies and go here. I don't want to lead anything, thank you. I am a craven man, not prone to fighting myself. You want to kill the other patrician? Sure, this might be an excuse for me to kill you too, though. I could just, like, land him as I take him into prison, right? I mean, that'd be hilarious. And then I could just sacrifice him to Satan. Or throw him in the oubliette. Either one's good. Grand Summoning! For some time now, my dear Chancellor and brother in darkness, Marcos and I, have been researching the proper ritual for invoking a certain demon prince. A few weeks back, our brethren managed to procure an ancient clay tablet with a missing incantation. We stand ready to attain powers undreamed of by mortal men. Unlimited power! Could carry serious risks. I am risky. Let's see what happens. Our coven surrounds the summoning circle, the correct symbols drawn, the fatty candles burning a sickly green. Marcos intones the final invocation just as I offer up the sacrifice. Distracted by the spurting blood, at first I don't notice the man standing on the circle like he was there all along. Looking straight at me with a smirk, he says, Bravely done, child. You have no understanding of the forces you are meddling with, but I did find your sacrifice pleasing. Quid pro quo... Name your desire, boy. I seek power! Oh my god, I get three intrigue! The blessing of Vetus, or Vetus. Also some dark power. Well, that worked out pretty well! Thank you, demon prince! I am more intriguing than ever! 
Blessing of Virtus. And it doesn't ever go away, as far as I can tell. Vettus, the Tempter of the Holy, has blessed this character with a devious mind. 29 personal intrigue now. Let's invite everyone into this plot. And it seems my dalliance with Margarita has resulted in a child. Fortunately, the patrician is an idiot and thinks that it's his. Ha <laughs> ha! Need a new marshal, apparently. Wait, what happened to the guy I just gave land? Does he no longer count? I'm gonna make my half brother into the marshal. You're gonna, you're gonna grow. You're gonna be a man. Can I send my wife a gift? This will not increase her uh, opinion of me. Right, let's try to kill that patrician then, shall we? Okay, these guys are coming back around for another pass. I think they're going after my trade post here. Which is rude. Looks like there are some revolts going on, so the Muslims are currently in disarray. I am fighting against the Emir... The little kid who lost his war against the Holy Roman Empire. I think those are his troops. I think I actually want to go kill these real quick. Well, he's coming back. Maybe we sit tight. Let's see what he does. If he comes after my trade post, I'll go kill him. Success! The snake has killed him. Oh my, these snakes are incredibly effective. Alright, he's dead. And he has a son. Oh, hello. Well, this should be easy enough for me to fix. Hey, Margarita, you ready to kill your child? Your little baby son that you just gave birth to? Yeah. He cannot be allowed to live, Margarita. For our love, you must kill your child. Sorry. Let's go for it. Little, little kid is uh, very, very dead. All right. Uh, what's this? The construction work being done in Genoa is coming along well under the meticulous eyes of a master builder who has taken me under his wing and is teaching me all he knows about constructing buildings. This knowledge will greatly help me in my work. The prosperity of the county increases slightly in Genoa. Nice. I'll take that. I'm wondering if I should build a hospital here. Let's build a hospital in Genoa. I know it costs me some money, but, but... We have been having a lot of problems with epidemics lately, and I'm tired of it. So, let's build a hospital. So, I have a lot of power. Um, what should I do with it? Can't dark heal anything. Don't want to divorce. Invite a disciple of Satan, maybe? Is it possible to find people who would not join my court? Like this guy. I don't think I can invite you. What are the prerequisites as far as inviting someone to court? Probably can't be landed, right? No. Where's, um, maybe it's an intrigue option here. Invite a disciple of Satan. Just a random one. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna invite a disciple of Satan. At the table today, my son is complaining about the food being too hot. He could become fussy. Which we liked. So I will touch the food to make sure. He did become fussy, which could become patient, greedy, or paranoid later. All of which are good for me. No matter what I do or avoid doing, there seems to be no good to make him relax. He won't eat it at all now, and I have no more energy to deal with it. Well, he's mad at me, apparently. I was just trying to help and check to see if it's hot. Alright, finally, my devout servant has arrived. Abjurer Felic Felicita is a most accomplished witch, and well-versed in the hallowed secrets of black magic. With her at my side, I shall continue to carry out the work of the great Satan. Holy freaking crap! Look at those stats, though! Look, she's a genius! Okay, she ha she's a lunatic as well, but that's fine. I'm a little worried about the ugly, but it's entirely possible I could have genius children with her. She's a master schemer as well. This lady is freaking awesome! I need to keep her. I need to keep her so bad. Abjur Felicita has been added in. I'm kind of curious. Is it that if you invite somebody... Oh, I have no longer have feelings for Margarita. I'm going to break off my love affair with her. I mean, the dwarf has been useful thus far, but is she really going to want to help kill her, her child? And she has consumption now. Ah, eh, such is life. I'm going to break up with her. She's not happy with it, but we can't have so many lo lovers anyway, right? Eventually we have to get rid of some of them. No, you may not have Felicita. She's amazing. This is my woman. And if Olga dies by crows, I shall marry her. She's already a Satanist. It's perfect. All right, we've been dancing forever. Uh, she adores me. Let's go ahead and get this. And we have a new lover with 25 freaking intrigue. She is so dang good. It's a shame she's a lunatic. Can I heal her? I don't think so. I wish that I could, though. I'm very tempted to have children with her. It's a shame that she's ugly, but... Yeah. Uh, let's see if we can kill the child. Perfect. Now, do I want to torture my brother or release him or anything? I mean, I don't know. 
my half-brother did kind of break my heart. We could banish him. How much money you got? <gasps> He's got 261 ducats. Brother, you are banished. I shall seize your funds. Wait, you didn't give me your funds? Hey, that's the whole point of banishment. The whole point of banishing people. And now you're in this city. Gosh dang it. Now he's in Pisa. All right, that was that was not how it was supposed to go. Banishing people, you usually fun, uh, steal their money at the same time. And the child's dead. I get their money. I get his title. Huzzah. And no one blames me. Perfect. All right, next patrician to die. Probably you. Can I kill you? Yes. I'm going to land you with the Cursed Barony of Luna. And then plot your death. And then invite everyone into the plot. Any new Lucifer characters? There's some people. I'll go ahead and invite you to court. I'm kind of curious. How often can I do this whole Disciple of Satan thing? I mean, freaking as often as I want, right? And I've got so much dark power. Is there any good reason not to? Let's try inviting another Disciple of Satan. The last one worked out so well. I'm going to freaking take Barcelona, by the way. This is going to work. All right, we have a new one. Another abjurer. She is possessed. She's also a renowned physician. She's pretty good at doing bad things. She's uh, also... Yeah... I mean, hey, we're just creating new characters that are going to work really well. Uh-oh, what's this? The Great Ball. A patrician refuses to have me, I think, at his ball. Every patrician family in the Republic has been invited except for yours. My dynasty's relations to them has been tense of late, and you're competing for several markets. So do we try to crash the party? I don't think so. I'm going to go ahead and lose the prestige. I don't see any good reason to do that, because I happen to know that that event can uh, make things worse, and you can lose, like, 100 prestige instead. Odds are pretty darn good, I think, that he wouldn't, uh, he would not agree to do anything else. What's this, by the way? Who are you, and why are you in blue? Oh, Pisa's army's over here as well, killing the... Hamadid Emirate? Okay, it's fine. Another son shall become thrift. So many thrifty sons. And one of them's dead. Okay, Sophia killed another one. I have heard it said that if I legitimize her, that problem goes away. I don't know if that's true or not. Maybe it is. I really don't know, though. We have a lot of children dying. It's probably okay, right? Another poisonous viper is going to murder the person who would not invite me to his party. This is what you get. I'll have you know. Trade post has been built by the Doria family in Roma. Perfect. I still have room for... Oh, nope, I'm over my trade post limit. Never mind. Okay, uh, I think that's because I got rid of my brother, actually. That's an oversight. I should have kept him in prison. He could have uh, managed a trade post from prison. Okay, she's no longer spy master. She was never my spy master. What are you talking about? I've inherited Luna, and he is dead. And someone revealed my complicity. I am now a known murderer. What did you do? It says I can imprison her, but I don't see that she's doing anything wrong. She's acted dishonorably towards me? Maybe... Maybe she revealed my plot. She's a known murderer. I think she revealed it by accident. My lover. Well, she's not doing anything evil as far as I can tell, so I'm going to let her go. Domain is too big. Okay. Now I have ten trade posts. Um, this guy next? No, this is the guy who didn't invite me to his party. He has 300 ducats. Okay, I'm going to grant you a landed title, the Barony of Luna. You're married to Margarita, the woman I gave up. I probably shouldn't have done that in theory, in hindsight. Oops. Um, but okay, let's invite another Disciple of Satan. Mm, we'll bring... Oh, wait, you're already here. Gotta join court. No one particularly good. Okay. Another abjurer has arrived. A genius hedonist man. Who is also possessed. Look how good he is. Let's send him a gift. Try to get his opinion up. 83. He loves me. Rank difference within Lucifer's own. This makes things so much easier. I have an amazing court. We're going to approve the plot to get you killed. So you're almost certainly going to join my plots. And you're pretty good at everything you do. Anyone else I could persuade? Margarita. If I sent you a gift, you would totally do it. Alright, let's join in. Yes, yes, we're former lovers and all that. But... You still like money, right? You still like the shiny things that I promised you a long time ago? Yeah? I think so. Oh, look at this. The Amali family is building out new trade posts. Venice is losing control here. 
Ancona? Ancona's become a merchant republic, really. Wow, we have a lot of merchant republics that are rising up. Interesting. Not sure how much I approve of that. Uh, I can't really spend my money to get any more trade posts, so maybe we just keep upgrading. I can't upgrade that. Maybe we upgrade my city of Genoa. The county capital. Mustering grounds, toll booth. Tax income, nine. Yep, grab that. Perfect. Okay, we're almost out of time, but we are starting to siege some of this stuff down. Court chaplain. I'm gonna get my loyalist in charge. He's not very good, but that's okay. My remains, uh, my plot remains unknown. Let's improve relations with the Pope, who doesn't actually own Rome, which I just find hilarious. Train levies? You're not doing very good as far as improving relations with anybody. I'm gonna try to fabricate a claim again. It's a 4.5% chance, which is not very good. But it could happen. And I really would like to take over this land. It'd be great. Can we please see just down a little bit faster? Tiny bit. There we go. Getting a little bit of loot. Just some cities and bishoprics and stuff left to go. Uh, and that will be the end of it. Let's go to speed 5. Another daughter has been born. I'll acknowledge her as mine. I can't imagine that my wife is very thrilled with me right now. Yeah, she probably shouldn't be my spy master anymore. I'm going to have you do it. This genius possessed man. You're very good at what you do. Uh, now, I could study technology and get extra tech points, which is very tempting. But I could really use slight improvements in my spy network, so let's do that instead. Now, he is fanatically loyal to me, which is awesome. I don't suppose... I mean, what does this mean as far as my council being loyal? They're not very loyal. He's still a pragmatist. Could I pass a law that's useful to me? Like revoking titles? I have supporters. Yes, let's try revoking titles. Send the law for review by the council. What does this do? Is this new? Huh, interesting. Yes, let's try to pass a law that allows me to revoke titles at will. That's going to make things very easy. Alright, we have another daughter acknowledges mine. A ship was lost. Uh, I could teach my son to be less nosy, or I'm just going to teach him to be less nosy, and I get some prestige. Just try to finish this. And we have approved it. Now I can revoke titles whenever I want. Also, my lover is once again doing things she's not supposed to be. Okay, I'm, I, I, I don't know what you're doing. County of Cornwall I could steal. Yusuchi is upset because he doesn't have a toy. He could become fussy. Yep, become fussy. It's fine. Fussy is good. Turns into useful stuff. 84%. I cannot piece you out yet. We're a little over our time, but let's keep going for a minute. I want to finish this war off so I don't leave you guys on a cliffhanger. We're expanding Genoa. It'll be great. Uh, we could try to relieve our stress. I think that sounds great. Olga might be upset, and she is very intriguing, but let's see what happens. I don't think I got discovered. She is very angry at me, mostly because I keep legitimizing children. Fired from council certainly isn't helping. I could send her a gift and try to make things a little bit better. I could try to possess my wife. If only I could make her join the Satanists, she'd love me. I'm going to try to possess my wife. Let's see what happens. In the middle of the night, I seclude my room. We've done this before. I'm going to do it. And, oh, wait, we're trying to kill somebody. Okay, that's good. And my wife? Wife? Failure. Okay, so no one, no one's dead. Did you become possessed or not? The ritual was a resounding success. Olga seems to have taken quite a liking to me, and is now far more amenable to my suggestions. The unfortunate side effect is that she has become quite obviously insane. So, now she likes me a lot, but she is possessed. Can I recruit her for Satan? I'm gonna try to do that too. I can't stop thinking about killing this prisoner. Oh, we captured somebody. Who are you? Oh, we could ransom these people. Resist my impulses. Ransom for ten? Sure. 26. What's... Hang on, what's this? Meeting with Olga. I made sure to only cautious... Oh, she doesn't seem... Yeah, she has no interest in joining Lucifer's own. Well, that's a bit of a shame. All right, well, I guess I can expect all of that to work out very well, but there we go. All right, so we're at 98% war score. We're about to finish sieging this down, and then we'll be able to end the video. I'm going to take over all of Barcelona for myself. He is offering peace. Catholics get moral authority. The Sunni lose some. I take over all of Barcelona. I accept. 
Barcelona is now mine. Genoa has grown officially. There we go. Thank you all very much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. If so, then be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. And I, as always, will see you guys next time.